Today, I'm doing a Minecraft mob battle with my girlfriend, but we can mix skibbity mobs. And what my girlfriend Zoe doesn't know, I set up this one-way glass wall so I can see exactly what mob she mixes. Well, anyway, Zoe, are you excited for today's mixing mob battle? I'm so excited, and you're so going down, Dax. No shot, Zoe, but I'm going to give you five minutes to spawn in your mixed mobs. Best of luck. Good luck, Dax. Okay, guys, and now that Zoe can't hear us, I can go ahead and spy through our one-way glass wall to see exactly what type of mob Zoe's going to mix. So let's see. What's she going to do for this first round? For this first round, I think I'm going to try to make a really cool multi-head toilet. Wait, she's going to try and make a really cool multi-head toilet? How in the world is she going to do that? First, I have to spot in a skibbity toilet. Okay, it looks like she put one skibbity toilet on this side, but what's she going to do for the other side? Then on the other side, I have to be super careful and spawn in a whole bunch of spiders. Wait, she's going to spawn in a bunch of spiders? Oh gosh, guys, this is looking really dangerous. Now I just have to hit the red button, so hopefully it gets me the multi-head spider toilet. Oh gosh. Gosh, let's see what this is gonna do and oh my goodness guys look it actually made a multi-head spider toilet this is so cool whoa i can't believe it worked now i have to go over and get a spawn egg so i can build an army okay it does look super super powerful which is a little bit concerning for me but i'm pretty sure i could figure out something good to make as well and my first thought for this round will be to use some super cool tnt and oh my goodness guys zoe is spawning in so many mobs okay quick we have to get to work on this side over here i'm gonna go ahead and place a few different pieces of TNT around. And then for our other side over here, I'm gonna go ahead and throw in a cameraman. And let's see if we can get some type of TNT cameraman. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and hit the button and let's see what this does. And wait a second. Oh my goodness. Did that actually work? Look, we got like a TNT version of the cameraman. He does look a little bit goofy and weird. I guess that's what happened when you start combining stuff. But now I need to go inside of here and just grab this guy's spawn egg so I can make a ginormous army of these guys. And Zoe does have a lot of people over there. So I think I'm going to have to help my army out a little bit more. And let's see. I should have some type of hidden trap door somewhere around here. Let's go ahead and see it. Oh, look, there it goes. And inside of this trap door, I have a super, super cool chest with some super cool things like this size changer. And basically now if I walk up to any one of my mobs and just click on them, they'll get super big. And oh my goodness, look how big our TNT cameraman got. Okay, let's go ahead and click on a few of these guys because I want my army to be super big because everyone knows as soon as they get huge, they're going to be like double the strength. And how about we get even crazier and make their size like three times what they're supposed to be so they'll be even bigger. And whoa, look how big this cameraman is now. There is absolutely no way Zoe could beat us in this first round of the mob battle. But before the walls drop, let me know who you think is going to win. You can comment Team TNT or Team Spider. Okay, Zoe, well, I think my army is basically ready for this first round. Are you excited to drop the walls and lose? Am I ready to drop these walls and win? Well, let's go ahead and see. I'm dropping the walls now. And here we go, Zoe. The first round of our mob battle has started. Oh, did you mix TNT with the cameraman? Yes, I did to make a super cool TNT cameraman. And there's no way that your stupid spider toilets can win. Um, it's a multi-head spider toilet and they're super strong. But are yours going to explode? Uh, probably not. They would explode if some of them died. But I don't think any of them have even died yet. I kind of want to kill one of them just to see it explode. No, so you better not touch my bobs and interfere. Okay, and it looks like a bunch of you guys are getting jumped. Man, you only have this one little window left and they're all getting beat up inside of it. Hey, what happened? My guys were supposed to be super strong. And you know what? Since your guys want to hide in there, I'm going to go ahead and bring them all out here. Are you serious, Dax? You're going to put them all in the center? Oh, wait. I don't even think I need to. It looks like you only have one guy left. And oh my gosh, Zoe, you just got smacked around this round. Man, I really thought I was going to win. Looks like I'm just going to have to try really hard the next round and I'm going to win. Well, we'll see about that, Zoe. Best of luck in the next round. Thanks, Dax. Oh my gosh, guys. We completely smacked Zoe around that round, but we need to go ahead and keep winning. So let's spy through our one-way glasses see what Zoe's gonna try and pull off for this next round. For this round, I'm gonna have to pull out the big guns and spawn in the buzz toilets. Okay, wait, she's spawning in the buzz toilet and that is an extremely strong skibbity toilet. So I wonder what she has up her sleeves. And then I'm gonna do something really crazy and pair the buzz toilet with the G-Man. Wait, she's gonna use the buzz toilet and the G-Man to make like an ultimate one? Oh no, this is gonna be kind of scary. Here we go. And wait a second, is that a buzz G-Man? And oh my gosh, it has laser shooting out of its eyes. Whoa, this guy is super cool and he he looks so strong. I have to go get a spawn egg immediately so I can start building my army. Okay, guys, I think the combining machine might have messed something up because look how bright and shiny it is. Oh my gosh, those lasers are coming through the walls. My army is going to be so OP when 
whenever I spawn a whole bunch of these guys in. Okay, this is not looking good. Look at all of these lasers that Zoe has going around everywhere. We need to focus up and get something really good for this round. Since the G-Man has lasers and lasers are like super, super strong, I think we're going to need to combine a mob with like a really strong block. So for this round, I think I'm going to go ahead and get some netherite blocks and use that combined with a skibbity bob. So on this side over here, let's go ahead and throw in some blocks of netherite, which is obviously one of the strongest blocks in the game. And then on this side over here, I'm going to go ahead and spawn in the Titan camera bed, which I had to shrink down so he could fit inside of this. And man, he is super, super tiny. But once combined with netherite, he should probably be like one of the strongest mobs ever. So let's go ahead and see what this ends up making us. And wait a second. Oh my goodness, guys. He is sticking through the ceiling. I can't even see him. Let's go ahead and run to the back so I can grab his spawning to actually see what this guy looks like. And you know what? I might as well just carry him out of here. And oh my gosh, he is so big. I can't even see him when I pick him up. Let's go ahead and smack him down. And whoa, this guy looks so cool now that he's covered in all netherite. And like I said, netherite's one of the strongest blocks in the game. So there's no way those lasers could take him out. But let's go ahead and grab his spawn egg just in case so we can grab a bunch of them in the game. And wow, this looks like it's gonna be one insane round. But since I still think we have a little bit of time left, why not go ahead and prank Zoe? And I actually have this one mob that lets me transform to any mob I want to. And you know what? I think I'm gonna change into Zoe's G-Man from earlier. And now that I look like the G-Man, she's gonna be really confused why this guy is back. But let me go ahead and get an invisibility cushion because I wanna go right where Zoe put the original G-Man. Let's go ahead and splash this on herself like that and perfect. Now I can head over without her noticing. And like I said, I wanna get into the same spot where Zoe was earlier. So let's go ahead and open this door up and then we'll just sit inside of here. Let's make sure to drink a bucket of milk so our invisibility will go away and perfect. Here we are. Wow, my army is super strong. Wait a sec, is that the G-Man from earlier? Oh, wait a second guys, Zoe noticed I have to change my voice as she talks to me. What are you doing here, G-Man? I morphed you with the buzz toilet. Oh, uh, what are you talking about? I've always been here. No, you haven't. I mixed you with the buzz toilet. That's why there's these creepy little things outside. Hmm, I see. Well, that is a little strange. Maybe sometimes you come back as your original self, which explains why I'm here. That would be pretty cool. So does that mean since you're the G-Man, you're going to lead my army to victory? Oh, uh, sure. Since I am the G-Man, I'm sure I can lead your whole entire army to victory. Sweet. That makes you the general. I trust you wholeheartedly. Oh, perfect. I'll get the job done. Oh my gosh, guys. I think Zoe actually fell for it. She thinks we're some type of general now, but she does have a little bit too many mobs for my liking. So why don't I just walk around and start taking out a bunch of her guys with this mob killer? We need to, we need to make her mob army as small as possible before all my netherite cameramen get taken out. Hey, G-Man, stop that. Oh, uh, what are you talking about, Zoe? Why are you killing my mobs? Well, some of these guys are just absolutely too weak and they don't meet my standards. Well, that doesn't mean you should kill them. We need the numbers. Well, they're useless anyway. So what difference does it make? Yeah, yeah. I guess I have to trust your judgment, but I'm just going to spawn more in. Uh, okay then. What the heck? Guys? She's spawning in more, but she says she does trust my judgment. But if she spawns in more, it doesn't even make a difference. What's something that we could do that's really, really destructive? And wait a second, I have the perfect idea. What I'm going to do is grab this thing called the lightning dynamite. And now if I go ahead and throw a few of these up into the air, a bunch of lightning would spawn everywhere. And oh my gosh, look at that. What the heck? No, my mom. Oh, this is so perfect. And since there's so much lightning coming everywhere, she won't be able to keep up and keep spawning in more mobs. I have to keep spawning in mobs, but they keep dying. Where is this lightning coming from? Oh, guys, this is so perfect. Dax, what is happening? Uh, What are you talking about, Zoe? Do you have lightning happening on your side? Uh, Yeah, it seems to be storming. Yeah, or is it taking out your mobs too? Uh, yeah, it took out a few of my guys. I don't know what's happening. It's really weird. You're taking out all my guys. We better start this map bottle ASAP. Oh, yeah, Zoe, so we can start. Can you give me like 30 seconds so uh, I can get ready? Nope, drop the walls. It, wait a second, Zoe, did you just drop the walls? Yep, we have to get this thing started so the storm doesn't kill all our mobs. Oh my gosh, guys, this isn't good. Wait, I have to blend it with everyone else. And oh my gosh, Zoe, your guys are taking out all of my people. They're super OP, but Dex, where are you? Oh, um, I was just watching from a distance. And wait, you guys have laser eyes? Yep, they have laser eyes. And we have a general, right, general? Uh, yeah, I'm the general of your army. You led us to victory. Uh, yeah, I'm the best ever. So, wait, what the heck? You can't have a general in your army. That's completely cheating. Why not? He was originally one of the guys that I, like, spawned in. And then he came back and he decided he wanted to be the general. Why are you running away from me? Oh, my gosh. That is absolutely ridiculous, Zoe. But, okay, I guess we can move on to the next round. No, we can't move on yet. Where are you? Oh, uh, 
I'm coming, Zoe. Just give me a second. Oh, guys, perfect. Okay, Zoe's walking away. Let me go ahead and transform back into my normal self so she doesn't notice. And hey, Zoe, I told you I'm back now. Where are you, Dax? I don't see you. Oh, hey, Dax. Yeah, see, I'm back. Nothing crazy is going on or anything. Where were you? Using the bathroom or something? Oh, no, I was just watching from over there because I wanted a better view of everything. But let's just move on to the next round. Hey being kind of sus guys what in the world do we completely smack me around last round i have no idea what even happened to my army those lasers must have been way too insane but i really need to focus up because now this court is one to one so let's see what zoe's gonna combine for this next round for this round i kind of want to make an infected speaker man but i'm not too sure how to go about it so i think i'm just gonna spawn in a normal speaker man. wait she's trying to make an infected speaker man how in the world is that gonna work and oh my gosh this guy is huge and then i'm gonna spawn in a parasite wait she's combining a parasite with a speaker man oh no this is definitely gonna infect him and then i just have to hit the button and let's see how it goes and wait a second guys it looks like it actually made an infected speaker man what that actually is pretty cool yippee it worked and then i just have to get a spawn egg so i can build my army this guy is super powerful i'm definitely gonna beat that okay guys everyone knows that the infected speaker man was like extremely powerful so i'm gonna have to think of like the perfect combination to beat this guy and i do like the idea of having an infected speaker man so why don't i go ahead and steal that spawn egg that zoe just got basically if i type in this command right here i can go ahead and see inside of zoe's inventory and oh my gosh and wait look there's the infected speaker man let me go ahead and grab this spawn egg so i can do my own thing wait where the heck did my spawn egg go oh wait a second guys i forgot to make a copy of it i literally just took it out of her inventory oh no this isn't good i guess it's not a huge deal i just have to get it for one of my mobs oh okay good zoe's not even mad or anything she can just grab another one but like i said i want to go ahead and use this guy to make like a really strong mob so why about on this side i go ahead and throw him in here and let's see what's a really strong block i can combine them with wait what if i just get some iron block iron's a pretty strong block so i'm pretty sure it'll definitely be stronger than those normal infected speaker men let's just go inside of here and grab some of these and then i'll go ahead and make like a little stack going into the air like that and lastly all we have to do is hit our button here to see what it comes up with and wait a second guys it looks like it actually made an iron variant of that infected speaker man this actually looks really Really cool. Let's go ahead and grab his spawn egg, and then I'll spawn in a bunch of them to be able to take out the army. And since this is going to be one big speaker man fight, I honestly have no idea who's going to win. But let me know. Who do you think is going to win? You can comment Team Iron, or you can comment Team Infected. But just to give my mobs a little bit extra help, I'm going to go ahead and go into my inventory and grab something called a Mob Enchant Book. And oh gosh, guys, wait, there was an achievement that just got shown. Um, Dax, what was that achievement? Oh, uh, nothing, Zoe. It's just an achievement I get for reading. Yeah, I'm trying to get super smart. Aw, Dax, I knew you could read. You just had to work on it yeah exactly zoe don't worry about it okay okay wow guys that was way too close but let's go ahead and use this enchant book to go ahead and click on some of my mobs and oh gosh wait it didn't work and wait it did work but look i'm glowing now oh gosh this is not good i'm glowing zoe's gonna get super suspicious quick we have to click on our own guys and there we go the first person in our army is glowing which means he's gonna be extremely powerful but let's go ahead and enchant a few of our guys because i want my army to be as strong as possible and perfect i think i have a good amount of my people that are enchanted now i think i'm ready to take out zoe's army okay zoe i think my army is basically ready to go this is gonna be one crazy round let's see who's gonna win let's do this and here we go the third round of our mob battle has started whoa are your mobs glowing that's insane yeah they are glowing because that means they're super super powerful which means they're gonna completely destroy your stupid speaker man this is not good my guys are dropping like flies come on iron titan speaker man Let's keep beating them all up wait dex are you glowing too uh yeah i'm glowing but i honestly don't really know why it's a little bit weird that is super weird hopefully you're not getting sick or anything Duh, i think i'll be fine but you know who's not gonna be fine you're super weak army no they're dying and it looks like that was your last one. Oh man zoe how's it feel to lose another round it feels pretty bad but not too bad because i'm gonna win the next one we'll see zoe if i win one more round i'm gonna be the winner of the mob battle but you won't win so that doesn't even matter we'll see about that let's go ahead and move on okay wow guys we completely cooked zoe in that last round which means i only need one round left to win the whole mob battle so let's go ahead and spy through our one-way glass to see what zoe's gonna try and do for this round dax is kind of inspiring me this round because previously he's been using iron but iron is kind of for poor people 
super rich, so I'm going to use gold. Wait, did she say iron is for poor people and she's going to use gold? Wait, what in the world is she trying to do? And then I'm going to morph the gold with the multi-head spider. Wait, she's trying to combine gold with a multi-head spider? Oh no, this is going to be super crazy to see. Here goes nothing. And wait a second, guys. It looks like it actually made a gold multi-head toilet. What in the world? That actually looks really cool. Whoa, this guy looks super strong and he looks super rich. Honestly, it does look really cool. So I'm a little bit nervous for this round, but hopefully I can think of something really good. And then of course I got to get a spawn egg. Come on out here with me, Mr. Spider. Oh my gosh. Zoe is going to spawn in so many, but don't worry guys. I can definitely think of something that can take her out. And wait a second. Zoe's spider over there gave me the perfect idea. What if I go ahead and combine myself with one of the toilets? So the first thing I need to do is grab a normal Skibby toilet and put it over on this side. But then in order to combine myself, I have to take this panic button and get rid of it and then go ahead and run a big redstone signal. Let's make sure the redstone actually flows into our combiner like that. And then I'm gonna put the button all the way over here. Let me just build it up and I'll put the redstone signal going this way and I'll put the button there in perfect. Now that I'm inside, I can go ahead and press it and see what I combine into. Hopefully this looks really cool. And oh man, my head actually really hurts. But wait, did it work? I don't see anything. And oh my gosh, wait, look at that. There's a Dax toilet now. This thing is so cool. And since it's me, it's probably gonna be like extreme powerful and destroy Zoe. So what I need to do is go ahead and grab the spawn egg and spawn in a bunch of them. And of course, I'm going to use a size changer to make a bunch of them super big too. Let's see, what size do I want to use? I'm thinking something like four will be really good. And oh my gosh, look how big it is now. That is so cool. But I need to go ahead and click on a bunch of them because I want to have an absolutely ginormous army. And just to be safe, why don't I also use this mob enchant book to make them super shiny and strong? This is so cool. Using these Dax toys, there's absolutely no way I can lose to Zoe's army. I mean, look how small and pathetic they look over there. Okay, let me go ahead and enchant a few more and then I should be good to go for this round. Okay, Zoe, I think I'm ready for this round. And let me just tell you, you're going to be in for a big surprise. Well, then surprise me, Dax. Drop the wall. And here we go, Zoe, the fourth round in our mob battle has officially started. Whoa, are those Dax toilets? Yes, they are. I can bite myself with a skimmy toilet to make a Dax toilet and they're totally gonna destroy your gold spiders. Yeah, I'm not too sure about that. The large Dax toilets are going down super easy. Wait, how in the world are they actually losing right now? They're like 20 times the height of your gold. Sometimes size doesn't matter, Dax. Oh no, this is not looking good. A bunch of my Dax toilets are dropping. Come on, guys, keep fighting. All right, Dax, it looks like you're gonna lose this round. I still have so many mobs. What in the world? It looks like you have at least five of your guys left. How is this even possible? Come on, I still have one big guy left. Keep fighting. You can take them all out. And no, he just went down. Sorry, Dax. All of your hard work meant nothing. Oh my gosh. And it looks like my last guy finally went down, which means you win this round, Zoe. You know what that means, Dax? Oh, fine. We have to go on to the tiebreaker round. Tiebreaker round. But don't get too happy because you're totally going to lose this round. Yeah. I don't think so. You're probably going to lose. Guys, I can't believe I just lost that last round of Zoe. Her army was so strong. But don't worry. This is the tiebreaker and I can still win this mob battle. So let's go ahead and see what Zoe's going to try and pull off. I am so excited for this tiebreaker round. I'm going to spawn in a normal skibbity toilet. Wait, she's spawning in a normal skibbity toilet? What in the world is she thinking? And wait, is that a lava bucket? And then I'm going to morph it with some lava in hopes that I get like a lava toilet. Wait, what in the world? Is this actually going to work? Okay, now I just got to push the button and see what happened and wait a second it actually made a lava toilet what that thing looks so cool this thing is awesome i've never seen anything like this surely this guy has to be super powerful okay he probably is super powerful and wait i can even see all these lava particles coming off of him okay her army is looking really really dangerous i have to think of something good well let's go ahead and see i definitely need to think of something and wait a second why is there obsidian behind my combiner uh i don't remember putting any of that there let's see what is all this hoopla about out and wait what is this like some type of portal but there's nothing on the bottom how does that even make any sense let's see what's inside of here and wait is that a little chest okay i think we have to go ahead and see what's inside of the chest because i'm super curious so let's go ahead and jump inside and wow this is a really tight space i honestly don't really like this but let's see what's in this chest right here and wait what in the world is this it says combo titan what in the world is a combo titan i've never heard of anything like that before well i guess we're gonna go ahead and see what it actually does let's go ahead and put one of these guys 
guys down and what in the world this looks like a combination between the camera titan and the tv titan wait maybe there's more cool stuff in that chest and wait what no the portal closed itself what no come back oh uh, whatever i guess we can still do something with this combo titan because it is really cool and wait i thought about something even cooler what if i go ahead and grab some emerald blocks and then i go ahead and combine this combo titan with some emeralds since emeralds are green and it's probably like the strongest block in the game, there's no way I can lose with this. Okay, now that I have the emeralds over there, let's go ahead and throw the combo guy down. And I guess I can just hit the button right here since I already moved it all the way over here. And oh my gosh, look guys, it actually worked. We have an emerald combo man now. This guy is super, super big. And since he's made out of green, he's going to be extremely powerful. Let's go ahead and spawn in a bunch of these guys because I want to completely destroy Zoe in this final round. And before the walls drop, let me know who you think is going to win this final round. You can comment Team Dax or you can comment Team Zoe. But guys, I better see no Team Zoe's because we all know I'm about to destroy her. Okay, Zoe, are you ready to lose this final round in the mob battle? No way, Dax. You're going down. We'll see about that. I'm dropping down the walls. And here we go. The final round has started. Whoa, you spawned in so many mobs and they're super big. Yep, I use emerald and a combo titan to make an emerald combo titan. That's insane, but the color you chose is kind of gross. What, Zoe? It's literally green. Everyone knows green is the best color ever. Yeah, I don't think so, but this is not looking too good for me. I don't know. A bunch of you guys are still alive. Man, they are really putting up a really good fight. It's getting pretty close, but you still have a whole bunch of mobs left. Come on, emerald combos. We have to destroy all these lava toilets. We can't let Zoe win. My lava toilets are super small, and they're able to outmaneuver your guys. We'll see. There's still a bunch of them left, but I think they're starting to fall. Come on, guys. We have to win this is take a bunch of them out and oh no a bunch of people are dropping now aha uh -huh, that means that i have a chance in maybe we'll see come on my guys have to take out all of yours you have a bunch left but so do i this is a crazy close fight come on guys take them all out we cannot lose to these stupid lava toilets come on die die come on keep fighting them come on there's only a few of them left and let's go it looks like i won zoe dang it i really thought i was gonna win there for a second well maybe you can win the next one zoe you have to get better at these i am I'm trying super hard. I think I'm getting better. And if you guys enjoyed that Dax and Zoe video, make sure to click one of the other videos on screen. Bye, guys.